All right, well, what I'm going to show today is just a basic electronic pulse motor uh, that's made using two coils and a transistor. And for this uh, demonstration, I'm going back to taking all the parts off of this. This is just hot wired to the transistor. I've got about uh, two and a half volts in a supercapacitor, a couple of coils, and a magnet that's going to spin around between the two coils. And this is what uh, I consider a basic electronic electric motor. Here's the circuit diagram. And this is as basic as I've found. I haven't found, any, haven't found anything that's more simple than this. It's simply two coils. These are air cork coils with a ring magnet, neodymium ring magnet, that's north-south facing. As the magnet spins and induces a current in the trigger coil, trigger coil is hot wired straight into the transistor tells the transistor to open up that lets the current flow from the power source through the coil through the transistor back the negative rail back to the power source and that's as basic as it gets I've never found anything except for a reed switch that is as basic as that and uh, this is why I'm just calling this the basic electronic pulse motor and I'm going to use my little friend Maggie there to show how the uh, energy coming off that ring magnet as it spins uh, will light her up. Uh, like I say, there's about two and a half volts stored up in that 10 farad super cap. There is nothing else on that board except that transistor. There's no resistors, no LEDs, no diodes, no nothing. Power source, NPN transistor. It's a 2N3904. You could use a 2N222 or a bunch of other transistors. For some reason, this thing is staying alive. I would have thought it would have blown it, but it hasn't. And uh, these are air cork coils. Uh, these came out of another project, and uh, that's actually Litz wire, which uh, didn't work on the other projects very well, but it worked really good on this one. Let me fire it up here. That's it. And this little thing here is uh, what I've shown before. It's it's an induction coil. There's no batteries on it or anything, and it just sh lets me see the output of an electric motor. Doesn't matter where you put it. It's just a couple of ball bearings on little supports. Uh, the electromagnets, like I say, are just air core. There's no core in them. It's a neodymium ring magnet, what they call a ring magnet, that's magnetized diametrically on uh, the outside surface. It's not magnetized this way. It's magnetized on the outside surface. And that's it, folks. That's all there is to that. That's about as basic, basic as you can get. basic electronic pulse motor.